had to make a video about this like females are still spreading this misinformation um okay yeah this is what medical this is what mainstream medical science says okay that it's the man who's throwing off women's ph whenever we have unprotected sex or whatever but in reality the truth is, it's the woman's diet at the end of the day that makes her pussy stink. You are what you eat. So if you're out here eating nothing but crab legs, fish fries, and fucking all this nasty ass shit, you're eating like all that processed meat, and you're, you're, you have no fruit in your diet, barely any vegetables just eating just nasty just meats and all the dairy and all that stuff that is the reason why your pussy smells like something died in it okay it's it's not a man's fault you are responsible for your organs like you are the one who balances your ph like it is no one outside of you it's only you that's making your pussy stink and it's it comes from your diet your shitty diet that's what these gynecologists don't want you to know because hello they want you to come with infections and um all this other stuff so they can prescribe you pharmaceuticals that screw you up even more and look at the comments here I mean, they never go to the doctor, so we can see that. Well, guess what? Those penicillin, those penicillin shots you get in your asshole, or whatever. Every time you have some sort of infection, you know, you bend over and just let them stick you, even though you don't have any text, re text, test results back saying you have anything. Some of y'all just still bend over and let them shoot you for GP. And guess what? All those little shots have side effects and. Um, you'll end up with a wart the next day or some kind of ulcer because your body's trying to purge of the poison that you was just injected with the day before. Um, that's how your body kind of works, but a lot of people don't know how their body works because they believe proper, just bullshit and they don't want to do research. Oh, the scientists do the research for me. I don't have to do this research on my own body on how to take care of my own body because doctors do it for me. All I have to do is just go get checked up by a doctor who quote unquote cares. But in reality, they get paid to fucking just prescribe you pharmaceuticals that will screw up your body. So you can be a lifelong client of theirs. <sighs> they throw any excuse on dudes. If your pussy, if your coochie stink, well, sorry, let me repeat. They throw any excuse on a dude. If you're coochie, stinky, just say that. And I love that comment. And this guy was like, okay, so what it means if it stinks on, what it means if it stinks upon arrival untouched. I mean, yeah, exactly. And then this dumb whore, I'm sorry, men really have a thousand bodies and still know nothing about sex and a man doesn't have to be dirty to make it stink he could have been he could be as clean as a whistle but if his diet is horrible and releasing in you you could end up with bv um what about your diet sweetheart the, your, your diet just don't matter it's only the man the man is responsible for your stinky pussy okay If she not even accountable for her own pussy, that's a red flag. Yes, that is a very that's very much a red flag. You are dealing with a retarded woman. If she will sit there and blame you for her smelly her smelly cabbage, her smelly cabbage. Now, um, yeah. That's all I want to say. <laughs>